change it to that. That should... Yeah, there we go, that works. Hello and welcome to Game Again. As always, my name is Jack, and welcome to the next episode of Mars Horizon, where we are going to continue on. Uh, I just want to start by announcing our next giveaway as the game music comes on. We're going to be doing another giveaway in February. We're going to do one every two months. And the giveaway is going to be a copy of this fabulous game, Mars Horizon. Uh, yes, we're going to have Mars Horizon as our next giveaway. Hello there, Ren. I'm just uh, filling everyone in on the next giveaway. We're going to be doing Mars Horizon, a uh, Steam key for that, <coughs> a gift card for the console of your choice, and a Gaming Kin t-shirt. These are three separate prizes for three separate winners. Um, we have got those coming up. Hey there Ringo, how's it going? So if you're interested in winning Mars Horizon, a gift card for the console of your choice or a t-shirt, make sure to enter the giveaway uh, when it officially goes live at the end of this stream. Uh, but in the meantime, let's uh, let's check out where we're at. Active missions. What are our active missions? We need to research some vehicle parts and set the, the training type and launch date for this one. So we're going to do. We're going to go with uh, some science training because we need as much science as we can get. And because this is a long one. We can go all the way to February and get maximum science. Um, does it include the KFC console? Um, the the KF console. Um, I mean, if they do gift cards for it, then sure. <laughs> I mean, if they have their own um, console store and and all that, then definitely can can sort that out. The giveaway Ringo is a copy of Mars Horizon which is the game I am streaming just now and I've been streaming for the last few Wednesdays since the game launched. Um, <clears throat> made by the amazing folks at Ardock Digital, uh, a small games development company in Bristol, United Kingdom. And we also have the Gaming Can t-shirt as well. Three winners, three prizes. See, we've unlocked Jupiter and Saturn. Uh, oh, we can go all the way, all the way to Pluto. But can we get past the the belt? Uh, this game is available on Switch, yes. Um, it is available on all the consoles and PC. And it is a great wee strategy game. You play, like for, for those who are just joining this stream for the first time, seeing this game for the first time, you play as one of the... Uh, you play as either Europe, uh, North America, Japan, Russia or China. You can be diplomatic with them as I have tried to be. Uh, or you can just completely, you know, race against them. Uh, how to join? I will explain that uh, soon. I've yet to actually make the giveaway official and live. There will be a link down to the giveaway uh, in my Twitch when it is officially live at the end of this stream. Because it is something that in hindsight I did actually forget to set up before <laughs> before the stream. Hey there Leslie, um, how do you... It, there are a couple of, um, I mean, I'm giving away the PC version, so either the the winner will have to add me on Steam and I will buy it for them that way, or there may be uh, giving a key for it. Um, we are we're not a hundred percent sure yet. The I'm I've been talking to the people at Auroc Digital about it and. Uh, things are in the works. <clears throat> <laughs> yep, 
Yeah, well, if they stopped typing while driving. Alright, so we'll assign some astronauts. Uh, navigator, do we have a scientist? No, we don't have a scientist. <laughs> uh, so we'll uh, assign that astronaut and we'll get as much launch reliability as possible and the extra navigation bonus. <clears throat> <laughs> hey there, Moxie. You absolutely love me turning the notifications on on your phone. You would miss out on all the fun if you didn't. So yeah, we'll uh, launch this one next month, hopefully. Um, we won't get as big a training mission, but we will get a, a modular space station on the go. Oh, Wolfie's off for the day. <laughs> Let's see. See what mission control looks like. Mission control looks nice and clear. even better, we've got a 2% chance of failure. We're going for it. The Polaris line of rockets has uh, definitely seen its uh, fair share of of use. <laughs> I mean, Junkie, perhaps all the, the loops and all the letters have been expanded a little bit. Uh, yeah, Wolfie, that, that one is based off of the Saturn V. So we need to achieve Earth orbit. Well, keeping our drift between minus one and one. We require ten data and ten navigation. So I think the best place to start would be... Getting ourselves some comms so we can use the comms to build up some data and navigation. Oh no, no, red straight away. No. No. Uh, I have six power, but it's only. It's reduced me by ten data. I will. Oh. Like two data, that's fine. I, I can live with that. We'll, we'll resist it anyway. Um, into the blue, that's what we like to see. And there we go, that is the first round we've got ourselves through. And then we'll go that and that. And then we'll spend a turn recharging power. We've got five turns remaining. Oh, we need to get to 20. Nice, <laughs> you parked now. <laughs>
Yeah, we'll need to resist that. We don't want to be spending data. So we'll go that, that, that. And hopefully we'll, we'll be in the blue again. Awesome. So a question for you guys watching, given the opportunity, would you go and uh, explore the cosmos? Would you make your way onto a spaceship? See what's out there? Well, I knew you would say no, Junkie. We've had this conversation before. <laughs> I mean, there is Starlink. Yeah, this rain's on my level. <laughs> I have never changed a diaper in zero G in neither of you, Drunky. <laughs> It may feel like it, but you've never done it. <laughs> Leslie, go home. Get to the bonus? Yes, as long as I don't get in the red. <clears throat> I would happily deal with that. Like, imagine if you waking up. Surely the cleanup won't be too bad. <laughs> I mean, I don't NASA would, but uh, if, if if you're going to contact any space agency for that, SpaceX is who you're going to be calling, surely. the module systems. Right, so lots of things. <laughs> Call up old musky, yep. Um right, what do we need? Nine, nine and nine. Eighteen for the bonuses. And we have to have our drift spot on. <laughs> You're both metal. <laughs> 
I mean, surely as you rotate in the the the, the lack of gravity in space, there would truly be no top or bottom. It would just whoever's closest to the Earth at that point in time. What oh, did we get in the green? We got in the green! Hell yes. Well, Rain, I've dreamt of going to space my whole life. Sometimes you, you you gotta work out the practicalities of these things in your head. I know worries, Ringo. You're more than welcome to lurk around here. that, get all the stuff, boom. <laughs> no way we make that. Oh no. <laughs> that, is, that is never a good sign. It's a sign you're getting old, Leslie. It is, it is a really fun game, Ringo, like... Oh no, not Fortnite. <laughs> uh. My younger brother plays Fortnite, he does not shut up about it. Uh, what we'll do... We'll complete the task there. <laughs> That's what Covid's done to you. I mean, I, I've thankfully managed to avoid, avoid it as much as possible over the last while. Uh, it was something I actually played on streams very early on. Um, what do I need to research? I need to research that. Which is why I'm. Yeah, that's fine. Um, we have an international space station now, guys. Construction is in progress, but we've got one. Uh, Going to do Mars things. We need to do Mars things. Ambitious, demanding, we'll do the demanding one. Go to plan. Oh no, we're already doing it. Very well then, we'll do the other one. So 
So we have six months till the next event, so we'll just boost on through. Oh man, Japan's at 25% Mars readiness. I'm gonna like get my ass handed to me by Japan here. I want to be the first to land on Mars. With people. Let's design a vehicle. Design a vehicle. Reuse a design. Here we go. The Polaris 12. Sounds like the best one to go for. We've got the 7, the 8B, the 9, the 10. Yeah, we'll, 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 go, to, we'll go to 12. That is a heavy lift rocket right there. You guys, just soon. Uh, yeah, we'll build ourselves. And confirm. Build the vehicle. We've got a funding review coming up, guys. Can we can we make it to tier fourteen and like get more money every every month? No. It's fine. We have a, another launch coming up. <laughs> Launch this mission. Oh no, the rain. And yet another variant of the Polaris rocket going up. Ooh. Do you know something? I think we can make it. I don't think rain's gonna take us down. Uh, yeah, I actually have the hoodie that I usually wear when I'm streaming this. Um, let me go and grab it. This hoodie here. It's a uh, it's a replica of the uh, spacesuit worn by Neil Armstrong um, during the Apollo 11 mission. It even has the Apollo 11 badge there. Uh, I would love to go to space, you know. Um, I think just it would be so awesome. Um, the the feeling of zero g weightlessness and watching like if you were on like on the moon instead of like sunrise you could see earth rise and i think it would be mind blowing what about yourself ringo No space for you. Sleepy says it's uh, drunky. Says it's no for him because uh, there's no Wi-Fi. But uh, I mean, the Star Starlink is is rolling out. 
that'll that'll give us low latency internet from space. At least if you're in Earth's orbit. At least that's what I let I uh, kind of hope would happen is it would work from from orbit for the ISS. Provided they fit a Starlink antenna to the ISS, obviously. Last turn, we're not. We're not making the bonus, so we'll just complete the task there. So we've got phase two coming up soon, where we will be probably doing like a, a mid-transit maneuver. Oh, I, I get that. I'm quite similar myself. I've try my best not to leave the house if I can at all avoid it one thing I like about this game is should you wish to not do the puzzles every time you can auto resolve it <clears throat> it doesn't auto, it doesn't let you auto resolve it for the important missions it's just three side missions to get you like extra mars readiness if you're at that point of the game or <clears throat> so you can just concentrate on doing doing new missions to get you money and things money and science uh what do i need i need to do that then that then that to get myself some trajectory going or some thrust No, 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 come on, out of the red. <laughs> I mean, spaceflight is getting safer and safer, like, all the time, with the addition of launch escape systems of different types and, like, abort sequences and stuff. If I do that and then spam this, I can build up what I need. I would like to believe. I just failed this mission for myself. No, I haven't. In fact, maybe I have. Can I do this? still be one short. Fact. <laughs> you like territory you can breathe in. I get that. I get that. 
Hmm. That and that. We failed this mission. I didn't think far enough ahead. That sucks. I need to hope we get like in the green now. I mean, if if we get if this bar goes up into the green for the final move. I can do it. If this one goes green, we can do it. No. Oh, lost the space. failed. Just lost his support as well, but I think we can retry it. I think we can retry it. Yes, we can. No, we can't. Metal stones, can we... Do we have any... We don't have any metal stones ready to go yet. Metal stones here? Um, no... So we'll go to the next month, we can, we've got the Hermes, we can research that. Well, it's going to give us a decent amount of science. And it's going to be relatively quick. Just playing Apex. <laughs> Are you talking about for the the giveaway, Ringo? Um, you can't sign up yet. Uh, tonight was just an annou an announcement of it. Uh, the official uh, being able to sign up for it officially starts tomorrow, or like once I have set it up after this stream. Um, those in the Discord will get a, will get let, will be told how to do it. Um, once it's officially open, and anyone else will find out the next time they watch a stream. Um, it's three months. It's got space station going. But yeah, uh, in my hindsight, I did forget to, you know, kind of set it up. <laughs> Because I am a bit of a tool sometimes. <laughs> so we have the Polaris 12 belt. Let's make some preparations for the launch. Training is going to be once again science. We need all the science we can get for a while. And it's going to be a November launch. And confirm that. Do you know what we can do? We can actually just uh, these will give us two percent Mars experience. So it will only take a month. So that'll be kind of handy. Um, We'll 
do that. Oh, we we're already doing that. We'll plan this mission as well then. To the next month. Well, just to the next event. We've got nothing on the go in the meantime. Let's see, we've lost support. But that's okay, not enough to take us down, down a tier. Uh, I don't enjoy Fortnite. Um, I suppose, in general, shooters aren't really my thing. Um, I mean, it really depends on on the shooter, I suppose. Let's design a new rocket. We'll design something small. Nope. Everything else is too small. Ah, that opens up some stuff for us. Oh no, that. That looks like it would work. Let's keep it. There we go, that will work. It's only sending something up to the atmosphere. We'll have a launch escape system. Be in the safe side because there is a crew there. But uh, no, nah, I'll play things like um, I'll play the likes of uh, Grand Theft Auto and stuff. But it's just one of those things. I forgot to like name that one the Polaris Fifteen. Uh, I've just realised. Um, so yeah, we'll boost to the next event. <clears throat> but uh, I think it's more the. To be fair, it's more the PvP than the fact it's a shooter that puts me off. Um, I generally suck at PvP. We'll assign two test pilots. So to the next event, got two launches coming up in a couple of months. We'll launch this mission. Continue on. another attempt at Mars. Here we go. We'll 
I need six thrust and seven comms minimum. I gotta keep my drift between minus one and one. I got this. So I've got a question for you guys. Um, for me, Wednesdays, I was planning on playing Carpal Space Program, uh, the the sequel when it comes out, which was originally meant to be early 2021 uh, after the first delay, but it's now been delayed to 2022. Is there any space games out there that you know of that you would like to see me play after Mars Horizon? Because ones I've been thinking about have been um, like No Man's Sky, um, Lifeless Planet, the original Kerbal Space Program, uh, One Last Outpost, if when that releases. I also have um, Space Engineers, I've been looking at Cosmocrats. Extra. Have we? Yes, we have. We've met the objective, so we will complete the task there. <clears throat> We've got our transfer trajectory. So, yeah, if there's any space games you would like to see me try my hand at, um, let me know. Um, otherwise, chances are I'll probably end up going with uh, Kerbal Space Program and just building ridiculous rockets and crashing them into the moon for a couple of months. <laughs> Have a ninety six percent launch reliability. I like the sound of that. And it makes it. <laughs> I, I hope my rockets don't explode when I launch them. Um, unless I'm playing Kerbal Space Program and it's an unmanned one. I like watching Kerbal Space Program explosions. But because I am racing against other space programs in this, I really don't want to be launching rockets that are just going to explode. Charge power in the last turn. 
Oh no! Oh wow! That is such a... Oh dear. This one's likely to fail a lot. <laughs> Drift. Uh, right, so we're going to go that, then that, then that. That? That should do us. We're going to have no energy to resist, but we can do that. Just hope we somehow make enough. Uh, except. Oh, we got that one. We got that one. hate seeing it in the red. Why did I take this mission on? I knew this was going to be ridiculous. What do I need? I need, I literally just need two day, uh, two comms. So it's fine. Two turns remaining. Hmm. Am I going to be able to do it? Ah, uh, that. Ah. Uh. That. That one gets part of the way there. Come on, come on, come on. Oh no. Stop going in the red. Uh, yeah, except um, as long as we keep everything above the objective, we're good at least. Let's make, let's make it six. Oh, we just made that one on the cusp with that one there. Right, so last turn I need six, six columns and three data. No, we're not. We're we're not getting it. We'll just complete the task. We're not getting the thing for it. Controlled re-entry. Yes. Let's deal with heat now.
Right, so I've got one heat at the moment. And chances are I'm going to explode. Um, because this is a heat based mission <laughs> and I always end up ruining it because of things like this because I've got a 59% chance of failing on this so yeah. I mean, ideally I'll be getting this back to Earth, safe and sound. But I certainly feel like it exploding um, is more likely. Start on the Pokedex last. Nice! How are you getting on with the Pokedex? I mean, if, if you need help, you can give me a shout. I can't, I can't promise. A oh, nice one. Um, but yeah, I, I can't make any promises. But uh, if, you, if you need a hand, give me a shout and I'll see what I can do. Three turns remaining. I just need to make sure I've got that. Uh, well, next time I'm on, I'll see if I've got pincer.
Oh, bonus resources, yes. Get the bonus. Nineteen percent Mars readiness funding review. A nice boost. We now have that, which means we can now build this. Need to set our next research, and I want to missions unity. Go to the next event. Awesome. So unity is ready. We'll finish off building the space station. March and water study will continue the mission. Phase two. Right, so it's decaying, which means it loses one thrust every turn. So... Need those and that. If we do, do that, that should, that will give us enough to get to the end of the mission. Don't have to worry about thrust. You all right there, Ringo? Take a turn, charge up. No, that takes it the wrong way. But I need it to be a three. Or do that anyway. Do that. Nice 88%, love it. Oh no, 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 no. 
Ah. I can afford to resist it and still get everything. It's all good. It's all good. We're good. Last turn, I know that I am fairly certain. The getting the bonus is not possible. None of the numbers out of my head, at least. What's up there, Ringo? Sounds like something's getting to you. Uh, let's go to diplomacy. Let's see if I can do a joint mission with. Who have I got the lowest with? China. Oh, the game. Polar analysis on Mars. To the next event. It's got like massive launch reliability somewhere. But I don't know where it is. Or which one? It, uh, that's got 96, so we'll go with that. Load the design. Uh, no, I, I, jazz isn't really my thing. Um, Normally, when it comes to music, uh, it's a lot of uh, heavy metal. Um, prog rock. Things like uh, Metallica, Megadeth, um, Rush. Uh, when I'm at work, I like to listen to smooth radio, which is kind of chilled out, kind of 60s, 70s, 80s. Um, back when I was in school I played the violin I got quite into classical music when I was playing the violin I mean I think the thing with jazz though is I never really gave it a proper chance more than anything um, Think if I if I did give it that proper chance, it would probably be I would probably quite enjoy it. Um, oh, straight away a failure. That sounds about right.
and then follow up by going with a positive success. Um, I mean, basically, as long as it's not dance music like that stuff that goes uns uns uns, then I, I'll give anything a try when it comes to music. Charge the batteries. Um. <laughs> I like some rap, not all rap. Like I couldn't tell you any rappers like that are current. Something else that I don't yet have? No. Oh. oh, yeah, I need to fix the drift, damn it. Oh, wow, I have screwed up. I wasn't keeping an eye on the drift. Some more rap. Um, I mean, if you DM me some of it on Discord, I'll certainly give it a try. Um, I can hope for something in green. And a failure. Lost to space again. <laughs> Just having no luck tonight with this one. Got any missions on the inner planets I still need to do? No. And I can't even investigate the sun yet. Oh, 
Oh yeah, we can do that now. Um, select the payload. Let's build it. Next event. Let's see. Uh, your team of expert, uh, a team of expert engineers, share as part of the ongoing collaboration between agencies on the construction of your module space station. Shared several technologies that can be used in the assembly of the unit. Oh yes. Some increased uh, reliability there. Let's go with two members of the crew. Let's send two astronaut uh, two celebrities up. Yeah, this is when we actually really kind of need some support, so. Yeah, we'll go, go for a bit of a later one. Maximum support. Oh, hold on. Have I just screwed up? Yeah, I have. I could have put the launch escape system on that. Oh well. Too late now. Got a retired astronaut. I mean, I don't have Fortnite installed on anything anymore. Um, <coughs> and in the uh, <coughs> in the Discord earlier, I was getting made fun of massively for having generally no space on my PC left at this point. But um, it has been so long since I played that I don't even I wouldn't even know where to start at this point like because I know it's like a whole different map and everything and it would be like learning a whole game from scratch again On. We've got the launch escape system anyway. Thankfully we had that launch escape system. Good thing we had the launch escape. Mars and Jupiter and Saturn. <laughs> yeah, 
Yeah, let's do a fly by a team. Let's try it. So we'll continue on. Polar analysis. Launch the mission. We've got our most reliable rocket ready. Oh, look at that, only a 1% chance of failure. No way we're failing this. Well, that's just what we can, you know, get ourselves to, to Mars now. We don't need seven and two. Seven and two. I think I could actually maybe I think getting the bonus rewards possible here. Can do it. I think we can get the bonus. Not when that happens, we can't. That 
that was unfortunate. But hey ho. Mission was successful at least. to the next event. We've built the stuff for our Titan flyby, we've built the Voyager. Just need to send it up in something now. Let's uh state we've got. So we'll go with the uh, Polaris 15 this time. And we will save that design and confirm. <laughs> Game getting to you there Ringo. stage yet so we'll just load this one and build uh, yeah we'll just auto resolve this that's what I'm going to do is actually call the stream here for the night. Um, I've got a lot of traveling to do tomorrow, so I am gonna get wound down and chilled out early. Um, so yes, as always, I've been Jack from Gaming Kin. This has been uh, another episode of Mars Horizon. Um, unfortunately, with regards to Fridays and Sundays, um, Drunky Friend is going to be unavailable for the foreseeable future, so I will be doing the Pokemon challenge that we're doing. It will be put on hold for the foreseeable future until he is uh, at the point he is able to come back. And I will be doing my Pokemon Shield Let's Play on the Fridays, and on Sundays, I have. I'm undecided what will be happening with Sundays yet, yeah, but we there will probably still be a stream here, just not Dungeons and Dragons for the foreseeable future. Um, I might take over DMing on a new campaign, which means I would need time to write it up. But yeah, um, I don't think there'll be a stream tomorrow night for AOR because the league doesn't start back till after the new year. Um, so yes, uh. As always, there is definitely room for you here at Gaming Kent if you want to be a friend. And as I say far too often in these times, stay safe out there. <laughs>